Hello, my name is Simon. I'm a normal ambassador and today we're gonna hunt for Capocale. Right now I'm about approx 300 meters from the first Capocale I've seen today. So we're gonna try to sneak up and get in a good position for for our shot. I really hope that we manage to get into a decent range. I'm so excited now. This is the first Cavalcade that I, that I have seen this uh, season. This is the third day that I'm out and trying to find the Cavalcade. I have finally shot my first Cavalcade this season and it feels so good. Uh, I saw the bird from around 400 meters and that's too far to shoot so I had to sneak up getting a little closer and I managed to set up the camera and I lay down but when I lay down in the snow uh, I didn't have a free sight for the boot uh, because there was some snow in the in the way so I had to get a little more closer and I was so sure that the bird was gonna fly away, but he didn't. He was just sitting there minding his own business and um, I was a little shaky and I was trying to calm down and I used a lot of time to to uh, get the rifle steady and that I was playing really good and the, the Capricelli went down. Ah, wow. What an amazing day. It's perfect conditions today. It's, uh, it's not so cold. It's, uh, as you can see, it's quite gray in the sky. So, uh, yeah, perfect. Let's go and get it. an old one. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. It's a really beautiful bird. I had a good shot placement and it fell straight down. Wow. <laughs> what a hunt. Oh. A really big bird. My goal for this hunt was to find a Cavalcalli and uh, I was so lucky finding one. It has been some really cold days earlier because I was hunting on Friday but I didn't see anything and Finally today the temperature is a little better. It's the sky is gray as you can see and that's good conditions for Capricale hunting. So this is a Capricale male. Uh, it's a really big one. You can see it on the on the mouth that it's really um, it's not so thin but it's more like yeah, it's really big. <laughs> so I managed to spot it at, as I said earlier, a long range and I managed to get in position and shoot it from 175 meters. So uh, it's gonna be a heavy backpack, I think so. And the bullet I was using is uh, Norma Diamond Line. I'm reloading myself, so um, I use Norma Diamond Line 130 grain bullet in uh, six and a half Creedmoor and I'm really satisfied with it it's great precision uh, it doesn't damage the the meat so much but it's enough punch that if you are not so lucky with the shot placement then you the bird don't fly so so well and you are able to find it 
Uh, I have tried to shoot with the uh, full metal jacket on Capricelli, but I feel that I want a little more punch in case that I do a bad shot. Now uh, the, it's not so late in the day, so I have spotted a Capricelli in that direction and a Black Grouse also in that direction, so we're gonna Gonna pack the bird down and uh, see if we can uh, get a new one. Wow, that would have been great. I'm really satisfied for this already, but uh, the bag limit is two birds and it's not so often that I have the opportunity to hunt on Capricelli, so we're gonna try to see if we manage to, to get in position for the other one on, uh, in that direction. Wow. Ah. Oh. Perfect day. Okay, so there are three Capricades sitting on. The range is now 380 meters. So I'm gonna try to get a little closer. I have my rifle ready and it's quite open here, but I hope I manage to get uh, within 200 meters. So we'll see. They have very good control where they are sitting right now. So I just pray that they sit in the line in the right position. Well, that didn't go well. I shot and I missed. <sighs> that sucks, but um, that's how hunting is. It's a small target and it's not so... Uh, it's not always so easy. I should have I should have tried to go a little closer, but I saw that he has detected me and he was ready to fly away and uh, so I took the shot, but uh I didn't see any feathers uh, and I don't think he got hit because I shot and he just hmm fly away. And uh I could follow him all the way because they were flying, there were six Capricellis and they were flying around and very long time and he was flying very, very good and so I don't think I hit him I probably shot right over him <coughs> well that's how hunting is I tried to find the Capricellis again but I didn't succeed but I can't complain I have a beautiful bird in my backpack and it has been a really nice hunting day. So thank you for watching. If you want to see more of these videos like this, please go into the Nurma YouTube channel, subscribe there and uh, please give it a thumbs up and a comment. Thank you for watching.